Thank you. Angeline looks so fresh, doesn't she? Yes. Yeah. Well, it's Looks like you've been on out. vacation, yeah. It's snowing out, which makes you feel very fresh. And you, you enjoy the snow. You're I a, love you're the a, snow. a snowboarder, aren't I, you? I've, I well, I would hardly call myself a snowboarder, but I, I have snowboarded in my life. Hey, well that's and something. I, <laughs> that I didn't spend the entire time flat on my face, so that's, <laughs> a, that's a good thing. But you did grow up in Canada, so you're mm -hmm. kind of familiar with I snow did. all that, right? Yeah, and actually this, this, uh, this Christmas I went to Switzerland, and no I was, kidding. I was snowboarding under the Matterhorn in the Swiss Alps, so no that was kidding. pretty amazing yeah I've had oh, my fair gorgeous. share of snow this year yeah you ever fall and hurt anything oh, uh, well <laughs> I actually, this time I, I fell twice. Um, the 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 first time that I fell, I fell so hard. You know when you catch an edge and and you see you, you hit the ground before you have a chance to put your your hands down. Mm -hmm. um, I couldn't see straight out of this side of my face for about the next three hours. <gasps> I, this whole side of everything went blurry and kind of spotty for about three hours. No kidding, and scary. then and then the next fall oh. I took um, kind of finished me off. My neck, I couldn't lift my neck independent of you know I couldn't. I had to like get out of bed like this and lift myself out of bed because um, I basically it was like head banging for an entire night I just gave myself such bad whiplash oh, oh my gosh I have to say I noticed that um, Evangeline on the prompter is spelled E-E-N to get you to say it right that's very sweet, <laughs> that's sweet. once so sweet. years ago I so said sweet. Evangeline Lewis yeah, I never heard okay. the end of it it's alright do you Sometimes travel alone to all these great places um, yeah well I, I do some traveling alone I, I also travel with friends and loved ones. And loved ones. Yes. And I also have a thorn in my hand right now. I did serious? a photo shoot with Matthew Fox in the jungle the other day, and I can't get it out. Right, I can get it right out there, you, you see it. You can get it. You want to get it out I for can me totally right now? Get it out for you. Should we get a pin out here? You can't see it on the monitor. It's tiny. It's kind of behind, under the skin, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, I can get that out. All right. <laughs> He, ha he once had a, a very infected splinter, and I like to call it a wooden plank. He had a plank <laughs> in his thumb, and I got it out on the air. A very on can, the air. I can wait until we. If it was go to infected, was break. there? Um, I mean, oh, you're we're talking you're nasty, right? No, you this is not attractive. Know. I can't believe he's still here. <laughs> <laughs> Shocked us all to survive. Let's talk about Lost. Now it's back for yet one more season, mm -hmm. and the plot <laughs> is more complicated than ever. Regis is very you know? angry that your writers killed the dinosaur storyline uh, after he exposed it on well, the air. I think they just got tired of him calling it a dinosaur, and they decided to move away from that storyline to spare us when we come here. You well, harassing I'm sorry us about, about the dinosaur that. I was just, it was just a guess, but a pretty good one too. You got it was a pretty good that, guess. Yeah. It was. <laughs> but now this is the last uh, last uh, cycle of shows. Uh, season five and then season six. Oh my God! Well, yeah, this will go on till forever. The, the, yeah. I know it's never going to end. We've got time travel now, so maybe. Maybe it what can, does that mean? Well, on They're the show, we're, 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 we're traveling through time. The island itself is actually traveling through time. Well, actually, that's not clear. We don't know if it's the island traveling through time or if it's the people on the island traveling through time, but somebody or something is definitely traveling through time. I have a time. feeling I'm traveling through believe, time right now. I believe that this really is a Club Med. That's what I think. <laughs> I believe that's the story. Really right, good we'll come club back med. with Evangeline in just a minute. Still ahead on live, the ultimate chicken wings by the Wing King. Angeline Lilly from uh, Lost. Now, we were talking about the plot, and uh, both of us feel like sometimes it gets so complicated that it's hard to follow. Mm -hmm. Definitely. You, can you keep it all straight in your head? Well, here's what I do. This is, and you could try this. Okay. Okay. Every season when I come back, let's say I'm coming back to shoot season two, I watched from episode one to episode 23 of season one. Coming back to shoot season three, I watched the entire first and second season, season four, first three seasons, all on the weekend. I'll get home, I'll watch it, I'll catch up, I'll go, right, right, okay, that's where Kate's at. Season five... I just couldn't do it. I couldn't do four seasons in a row of my show. So That's what I did yeah. is I went online, and there are these amazing things on YouTube that the fans create, which are basically music videos of Kate Austin's life. And I just watch those. <laughs> it's like they've done my homework for me. So we can follow you specifically mm. if we go on to these yeah, fan sites. exactly. Anyone. You can choose a character, and there are like 5,000 music videos of each person on, mm. on YouTube. And that's how mm. I do my homework. Now, that's how I keep up. But Regis well, is going to have to learn how to use a computer. Right. Right. <laughs> right. That's the first going. step. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so what happens to your character now in this fifth season? 
Can you tell us some of the things that happened to her? Well, um, as, as everyone knows, she's now a mommy, right. which is very exciting to play. And, and little William, my counterpart, is, is a blast. He's two and a half. So playing with him is much simpler than playing with the big boys. Um, <laughs> and and she, I, I can't really tell you exactly what happens with her, but basically, um, you know, there's only so long that an ex-convict on the run can, can pretend to be a mom of someone else's child without it sort of coming I to a head I don't know point. about that. I've seen a few episodes of Cops, and it can happen. <laughs> <laughs> it actually can go on and on. Uh, well, let's take a look at you in action right now. You are revealing to Jack that someone wants to take the child you're raising and talking about right here. Lost. <laughs> Jack, uh, I don't know why you called, but I can't be dealing with this right now. I... What's going on? Nothing. Just... Can you just go? Why don't you just tell me? Jack, please Kate, just go. Just please tell me. Somebody wants Aaron. What? There's a lawyer in there. His clients, they know we're lying. They know I'm not his mom, and they're gonna take him away. Who's gonna take him away? What are you doing? Look, I gotta go. All right, get in or don't. Oh, now I know what's happening. There's a dinosaur in the trunk of that car. <laughs> now I get it. Anyway, everybody loves the show. It's lost. It's on tonight, as a matter of fact, at 9 o'clock on ABC. Benjamin, nice to have you here, Thank you. Happy New Year to you. All right, the ultimate chicken wings. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Tomorrow on Live from the film New in Town.